Right, how you going viewers? Rob from Hoogie Mouth Tackle, we're out here at Altona. Quick lunchtime flick, maybe 45 minutes. It's uh, low, really, really low tide and uh, there's no wind. So we're just gonna flick a few soft plastics, see what comes of it. Stay tuned. Okay, we've got super clear water and the weed beds are straight out there, so that's where we're headed. We'll see how we go. No bait, just flicking soft plastics. Let's get amongst it. Yep, we're on. First cast. First cast with the plastic and we're on. What we got here? Nice little flatty. Yep. He's completely swallowed that. Nice. Alright, I'm going to manage this. There you go, on the old motor oil. It'll be about 30, anyway. Let's um, let this little fella go. I'll take the pliers. Here we go, off he goes. That's one straight away. First cast, so not a bad little uh, take on the um, motor oil, slim swim. Stay tuned. Because the water's so clear, what we're gonna do is we're just gonna throw a squid jig over the side as well. Never know your luck in the big city. I can get that untangled. Come back to that. Picked up something here. There's no head shakes, there's no nothing. It's a flathead though. Not much of a fighter. There he comes. Oh, he's woken up now. As you often get that with the flathead, they don't wake up until they get off on the top of the surface. That's two in two in ten minutes. This is probably a bit bigger than the last one. I just want my plastic back, mate. And you can go free. There he is. Just pop him down there. Get this plastic straight back out. He's probably about yeah, 30, 31. Anyway. Off you go, buddy. There he goes. Oh, he's a bit slow to take off. And he goes. He'll be right. 
ready to fight another day when he gets bigger. All right, so we switched over to the turtleback worm now. We'll give that a go, just something different. Even though we know that the uh, the um, motor oil is working, it's always good to just change it up. So, a bit of fun. These turtleback worms are they're pretty good. They're pretty successful. Okay, we're on here. It's on the soft plastic. Slowly coming up. Picked him up off the bottom there. Strange little fight, but we've got this little uh, flathead here. He's having a run. Here we go. Oh, that's a decent size. Alright. Just bring him in. There we go. Well, it's good Friday. And there's some dinner. in order here. He's off. Lovely. Uh, as always, on a clear day, can't go past the uh, motor oil slim swim. We'll just uh, dispatch this guy so we don't lose him. Okay. kick at him, lovely spots on him, and he'll come over for dinner. Happy Good Friday. Fish dinner. I haven't brought an esky or a bag or anything today, so we're just gonna pop him in the old, the old uh, keeper bag here. Good start. Okay, we're on here. We're on the white bait this time. Trying something different. Feels pretty big. Feels like a good fish. Yeah, it is a good fish. Oh yeah. Whoa. Getting that ready for this guy. It's a good fish. Oh, he's darting. Look at that. Oh, yeah. He's got a bit of kick in him, this guy. I'm just going to land this fella. He's in the 40s. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, he's come woken up. There we go. We've landed him. The white bait. Goodness me. Oh, that's high 40s. That's a good fish. On the top, bottom hook as always. Pretty satisfied with that. Very satisfied with that. So we thought we'd try something a little bit different today. We'd try to try out the, uh, the white bait and it's paid off. Certainly has. 
pop him over there. Oh, that's the way. Right, he's still hooked up, so I'm just going to quickly dispatch him so we don't lose him. If you've seen some of my other videos, you'll see that I've lost quite a few. We're not going to lose this big guy. If I do have a measuring tape, it'd be nice. Alright, now that's a caught him on that. Oh yeah, look at that. It's a nice fish. So we've caught him on the um, red flasher whiting hook. You can see there it's pinned him right in the corner of the mouth, so it's done its done its job. See, there we go. Beautiful. He's still got a bit of kick in him. Alright, so he's unhooked now. Uh -huh. Oh, look at that. That's a good fish. Pretty happy with that. There we go. It's a nice, chunky, flatty, probably in excess of 50 centimetres. Gotta love that. Couple of little nibbles on this one then. Might have baited me. Something had a crack at it, but um, didn't quite hook it. On here, I'll just cast that one out. Saw a big bite. Oh, it feels heavy. Not much of a fight, but it's it's quite. Oh, oh, whoa, whoa! Hang on a minute. Just pulling some decent drag. This is a big fish. Oh yeah, this has got some grunt. This is a big, big fish. I've seen some colour there, just whipping under the yak. Oh, it's a big flathead. Oh, he's got... Oh, look at that drag he's taking. He is just thundering. The white bait, look at the size of this guy. Alright, whoo! Yes! Oh yes! Look at the size of this guy! That is a stonker! Woo! That is a absolute stonker! Look at that! That is gonna push 60. White bait. Oh, that is amazing. Look at that. He is huge. Oh, mate. Ooh. That is one big boy. Gonna dispatch this guy. 
this oh the sinkers the hook's gone right through. Come right out his nose. Alrighty, mate, you are huge. Oh, look at this. That is a fish and a half. Goodness me. Woo. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. These lip grips. Have a look at that. Now that is what it's all about. That is an absolute cracker. I'm not taking any risks. Well, Good Friday dinner is looking, looking the goods on the running sinker, ladies and gents. That's what you call flathead fishing. And it's time to go in. Here we go, just landed this stonker. That's gotta be 60. It is a monster. Look at that, what a beautiful fish. Just caught him on the, um, on a running sinker, long shank hook, on a piece of white bait. There we go. Ooh. Get in there, bad boy. 